I like to tell a story to all my radio and TV students that are watching. I had a class for filmmaking with Professor John Daly. We had a 15-week assignment to produce uh, some type of film or video. My partner and I, we worked for 15, 15 weeks. We had the whole project finished. So I took the tape. I went into the TV studio. It might have even been this studio. And I put it in the machine, and I laid black on it. So the next day, that Friday, I went to the, to the studio, and I met my partner. And I said, everything's ready. We're all set. And we just got to lay this one piece of film on the end, and we'll be good. Put the tape in, and I press play, and I'm waiting, and I'm waiting, and all I see is snow. So I said, oh, okay. So I fast-forwarded. I didn't see anything. Then I rewound it, and I still didn't see anything. So I said, that's strange. So I went to um, see the TV uh, engineer, the radio and TV engineer, um, the late Ron Orlando. He uh, was one of the people that kept the station running at all times. So I went to him, and I told him my problem. So he looked at it, and he turned to me, and he said, are you sure this is the tape? I said, yeah, that's the tape, Ron. We've been using it for the whole semester. He said, okay, no problem. We'll find it. He started doing all his little tricks, and then he said to me, well, when you put the tape in, did you post roll? And post roll, those of you that uh, know TV know that when, a tape, when you put in the tape, it, all, it rolls all the way back to the beginning, and you're supposed to post roll to the end of the tape. So I forgot to post roll. So I said, well, no, I, I, I didn't. I forgot. He says, well, I hate to tell you this, but you just erased your whole 15-week project. I said, you got to be kidding me. He said, no, I wish I was. He said, don't worry about it. He said, come with me. I'm going to go talk to Professor Daly for you. I said, okay. So he went to Professor Daly, and he said, uh, Professor Daly, Silas uh, mistakenly erased his whole 15-week project. Professor Daly looked at me. He looked at Ron. He said, you got to be kidding me. He said, that's terrible. He says, oh, my goodness, I don't know what to say. And then Professor Daly looked me right in the face, and he said, I'll see you on Monday morning, and he walked out. So what that told me was that even though it was my mistake and even though I worked for 15 weeks, that the project was still due on Monday morning. And so I spent the rest of the weekend uh, putting together another tape, editing it, and walked in class Monday. My partner was totally beside herself. She was about to have a panic attack. And I walked in. I said, it's okay. We got it. So I gave it to Professor Daly, and he said, you know, he says, I'm really impressed. He says, because when Ron came and told me you erased your whole project, he said, I thought you were going to pass out. He says, and the fact that you were able to get some kind of project and turn it on time, he said, that's very commendable. And so I share that story to say that we, we have to be able to meet our deadlines regardless of what the circumstances or the situation is. And sometimes when your back's against the wall, uh, you never know what you're capable of. So never give up because there's always that little more you can push out of yourself, and that makes you the winner that you really want to be.